Welcome to Sailor.org's Introduction to Word Processing course, part of our Professional Development Program of Study. The courses in this program are designed for adult learners who want targeted skills they can immediately apply in a professional setting. Intro to Word Processing was created with the beginner in mind. Are you online? Check. Did you play this video? Check. Then we're willing to bet you have the skills to successfully complete this course. But before we even get started, I want to give you a helpful hint. You should create a folder on your desktop to store all of your documents for this class. Having everything saved in one place will keep you from having to waste time searching around your computer for the documents you create. You can pause this video now and go create that folder. In this class, you will learn to format a business letter and a business memo. There are several word processing software programs available, but for the purposes of this class, we'll be using the current version of Microsoft Word. But don't worry, these skills are transferable. For instance, all word processors will allow you to customize a document with font size and style, paragraphs and line spacing, images and clip art. So no matter what your preferred word processor is, we've got you covered. In Unit 2, we will begin by creating a block style business letter. This is a widely used and simple format that you've probably seen before, maybe in a letter from your employer. We'll show you easy to learn style guidelines so you can replicate it for your own professional use. Moving to Unit 3, we'll highlight word processing skills used to create a block style business memo. Although they often follow a certain format, memos are less formal documents and we have more range in style and formatting. For instance, you can emphasize text using bolded or colored text. This course is designed as a brief workshop and should only take you about three and a half hours to complete. But we encourage you to explore your own word processing program and find where all the tools are in your program. New programs come along and familiar programs change. If you stay flexible in your thinking, you'll always be ready to go. All right, let's get started.